Hey guys, how's it going? My name is Orchard Runner and welcome to Baleful, a free indie horror game which you can download right now on itch.io. I'll leave a link for it down in the description box or the bung bar, whatever you want to call it. Alrighty ho, it's just basically a haunted house horror house simulator. It's supposed to give you jump scares and whatnot. And to be uh, quite honest, there's no main menu. I just opened up the application and boom, I was thrown into the game. No explanation whatsoever. So there's no backstory, it's just gonna be a jump scare fest. Okay, left click, lights and doors to interact. Good to know. Okay, now we've got a bit of light on the subject, can we get out? Alright, I think we got a bit of a key situation going on here. So is there a key around here? No, oh. Oh, somebody must have been painting. Silly painter person. Paint sheets aren't supposed to go back in the basement. You're supposed to throw them into the washing machine. Jeez, I mean, if, if, if I hired a painter to, to paint my house and he just left these raggedy goods behind him, boy, he would not be getting any recommendations from me. Okay, left and right click objects to pick up and throw them. So left to pick up. And right to throw them, so it's kind of similar to amnesia in that in that sense. So, are you telling me that the key is going to be behind here somewhere? Maybe behind in one of these boxes. And spacebar to jump in low gravity. That's cool. Oh Jesus! Everything's so low fucking gravity here. Will you get out of my face? Or you can just stay like that, that's cool. So is there any key here? No. Um, left control to crouch. Oh, right, yeah. Are you sure I can fit in here? It doesn't look like a space I could fit into. Oh, I can. Definitely would not be able to fit into a space like this in real life. I am a bit of a tubby at the moment. Freedom! Get out of my face! Ooh. An ominous stairway. Now, what do you think will be at the top when I turn on the lights? A door. Oh. Well, um... That's slightly disappointing. Okay, but the real question is, what will be behind said door? Mm, another room. Yeah, okay, that that's cool. That's cool. Lulling me into a false sense of security, are you now? Game? Or Mr. Developer? Or Miss Developer? Oh, wow. Oh, cool, look at that. The way the picture refracts off the glass. That's kind of cool. And notice how the glass doesn't crack. Oh, that, that must be um, a pretty strong glass bottle right there. Yeah, guess we can't go out that way. Okay, so where are the jump scares? I'm expecting something scary to happen. Get out of my goddamn face! Oh. Oh boy. Oh, somebody scared is going to jump out of me. I just know it. Uh, it's a kitchen. Okay, that's nice. Can I go in here? No, locked. Well, there's always more than one way to get through the door. Smashy, smashy, smashy. No. Blast out some Mozart on the piano. No, I didn't think so. Can I interact with the drawers here? No. Books? Hmm. Alright. That 
was a whole bunch of nothing, a whole bunch of flip flaff, flu flaff. And there's nothing in here, no? Okay. Whatever you say. Ooh, telephone. Can I use this? 999. Hmm. Nada. Useless. Wait, whoa, whoa, whoa. A key. Oh, I know exactly where to use this. This door. Okay, no, we're not out of doors just yet. Because we all know there's more than one door in each house. Just gotta find them. Look, there's more doors down here. There's a door here. And a door here. But I can't use the key on either of them. Ooh. An ominous TV set. An ominous lighting to go with it. <gasps> oh my god. There's no light fixtures in this room. You can't stare at a TV with no backlighting. That's just bad for your eyesight. The lock is broken. Objective, find another way to escape. Ooh, automatic lighting. Okay, I guess we're going up here then. A mirror that has no reflection. Or that reflects nothing other than the lights behind me. So fancy. What? What's up with this picture? What's up with that? Um. What the hell? It's a mirror containing a picture. Some of some. I I don't know how to explain this. This is just weird. Okay, well, whatever. I mean, it's a free indie horror. I mean, obviously not every aspect of it is going to be perfect. Okay, can I go through here? Yes, I can. What what's in here? Ooh, le amour de l'amour. That is the room of love in French. Although I doubt that there's much loving going on in here. Hmm. Well, that, that was pretty pointless. I was hoping to make my escape through that window, but... Yep. The game would have me do otherwise, and... Come on, there's got to be some spooks in here. A dead body, perhaps? Nope. Nothing. Just a poorly decorated bathroom. And a picture. Hold left click to rotate and use the scroll wheel to zoom in. Oh. That's spooky. That is pretty damn spooky. I mean, who is that or what is that? Is that a human? Is that the guy who's inevitably going to kill me? All these questions yet to be answered. And there goes the phone. Right, I'm coming, I'm coming, come on, hold your horses. Hello? You have one unheard message. Please enter the three-digit password, followed by the pound key. Not gonna happen because I do not know any such password. Oh. That's... ominous. Yeah, let's go around this light. 
Ooh, an automatic door. I love modern technology. So what do I do in here? What? Hold left shift to sprint. Ooh. Stay back, I got a chair. Aha! Now you can't get in. Wait, no. No, come on, come on. Get, get, get. Yeah. Okay, good enough. That'll stop him for the time being. Or at least slow him down. Okay, right, we got a lamp and three playing cards. Okay, we got a jack, a queen, and a king. Ooh, very shiny. And what's on the back? Oh, tree. Ah, the voicemail code is going to be on these. So we got a tree. There we go. Will you stop? Got a tree, an eight, and a four. Yeah, okay. So 384 is the passcode. But I can't get out! What the hell? Okay, clearly there's something to be done in here. Can't go in there either. Can I just jump over? Oh boy! Fucking hardcore parkour up in this bitch! Throw that chair over there, so what is this all about? Okay, we gotta get a picture of what looks to be Prince Charles. Another picture of who appears to be Napoleon. And a picture of good old Queen Lizzie. Okay, I'm just kidding, I've no idea who these people are. Wait, hold on. They're all on timers. Oh, I get it. I get it. I get it. I get it. So I gotta turn on all three lights of these paintings for me to escape this room. Okay. Alright. I got it. Freedom! Okay, no, that didn't work. Wait, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Wait, 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 wait. A jack, a queen, and a king. Oh, I think I get it. Now we gotta do them in a particular order. Gotcha, so we got Jackie. Um, wait, jack, a queen, and a king. Queen and Kingy. <laughs> oh, oh, good, good. Whoa, 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 whoa. Shh. No, 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 no. Close that fucking door, you fudge knocker. Um. You all right there, buddy? <laughs> he seems to be a little stuck. What's up with you? You, um... You practicing your moonwalk? Are you aspiring to be the white Michael Jackson? Don't give up on your dreams. I believe in you. Okay. Did I break the game? Oh, no, 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 oh, there, there he goes, there he goes. Is he going to be a threat? Like, is he actually waiting for me somewhere? Hello? Can't exit that door. And you can't go out that door either. Oh, I'd have to password now. So 
So the password is... You have one unheard message. Three. Please enter the three-digit password. Oh, shit. Followed by the pound key. Well, I'll pound you. You have one unheard three. message. Please enter Eight. the three-digit password. Four. Followed by the first unheard message. Oh shit. Oh shit, oh shit. Oh god. Oh no, 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 that doesn't sound would be good. Those aren't heavy noises. Is he going to myrtleize my ass now? Was that a trap set up for me? Does he now know my location? I mean, is he going to be chasing me around the house like a madman? Oh, that door's open now. Hello? Oh, well, don't this look inviting. Okay, take it easy one step at a time. Oh, hi. Nope. You can stay down there. At first, you need protection of some kind. Okay, a book. The power of whatever is contained within this book compels you. Okay, that did nothing. Okay, I have one more idea. So one more weapon of choice. A chair. Oh shit. Hold on a second. Bear with me. All right, coming. Okay. Three, two, one. Whoosh! What? What? What the hell? Okay, I definitely need this chair more now more than ever. What? Okay. Baleful. I can't. Uh, but it just transported me back to my desktop. God damn it. Uh, well, okay. I can't really say it was scary. A little unsettling, but um, scary. Um, ah, nah. I uh, know indie horrors like this have become a cliche. I mean, it's like this guy didn't e even try. I think he was just trying to troll me more than anything, or troll us or the player, the consumers, more than anything. But, uh, I mean, I suppose it did look nice, sort of visually, just toned down the sort of uh, shininess of the game. I mean, th that was a bit uh, over the top. But yeah, I'll just leave it at that. So guys, you know what to do if you did like this video. Be sure to give it a thumbs up, comment right share, and most importantly, subscribe. And I will see you in the next one. So until next time. See ya.